Other news this afternoon, bandito or executioner, L.A. County Sheriff orders deputies to show their mm -hmm. ink. Now, an investigation into alleged deputy gangs takes another turn. The sheriff now threatens to fire anyone who doesn't cooperate. KCAL's Jeff Nguyen spoke with a legal expert as well as the man leading the probe. Less than two weeks after the Office of the Inspector General ordered dozens of L.A. County Sheriff's deputies to face questions about alleged deputy gangs, L.A. County Sheriff Robert Luna sent out a department-wide email reading in part, all department personnel who received such a request are hereby ordered to appear and cooperate in such interviews. Lori Levinson teaches at Loyola Law School. The letter is loud and clear that he wants his deputies cooperating with the Office of Inspector General and showing their actual tattoos. Max Huntsman says the notices were sent to 35 deputies. The ultimate goal is to have a list of all of the members of the groups called banditos and executioners. In the case of the executioners, there's a, a, a Nazi helmet in that tattoo. Uh, we've selected uh, deputies who we have reason to think will have helpful evidence for us. And we didn't just make these uh, names up or pull them out of a hat or something. One of the unions that represents a sheriff's deputies released a statement saying it's concerned about various aspects of this investigation and the manner in which Mr. Huntsman apparently intends to go about it. Huntsman says the probe is looking at a new penal code section that prohibits discrimination based on race and and gender. Any says membership in law enforcement gangs is against California law. This is to exonerate people as well as to show who uh, is behaving badly. The investigation also aims to provide a list of gang members for other agencies in the future. People have the right to assert the Fifth Amendment if they think they're going to incriminate themselves. The previous sheriff, Alex Villanueva, fought the inspector general's subpoenas in the investigation, but the pendulum swung in the opposite direction after Sheriff Luna took office. Part of the reason he said he should be elected was because he wanted to clean up his own department that he wanted to cooperate and have that transparency. The letter that was sent to the 35 deputies gives them 14 days to schedule an interview. Huntsman says those deputies can have legal representation with them. In downtown LA, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL News.